Yo, let's make another video. Now we're gonna swap keys on the account because on Wax you can actually change the keys associated with your account. On Bitcoin the key is your account. On Wax instead you have an account name which uh, you can swap keys and you can actually have some keys with custom permission so you can have a key that is only allowed to interact with a certain dApp and things like that which is awesome to make sure that your tokens are very secure so uh, perhaps you were in the beginning when you had to make an account with scatter uh, or some other wallet uh, and you have all the keys that you want to add to maybe a ledger or maybe something else. You, you just want to swap the keys. You, know, you want a new owner key, you're, known, you're a new active key or whatever. So the first thing first, we need to uh, add an account uh, ledger and then we take number nine because we want uh, uh, a new key. I will take this key. I already have it with one account, but you can have the same key, uh, same key on a lot of accounts if you want to. I will copy this so I have it. Uh, and if you wonder why I just took nine, I have an explanation when you um, look at the, how to make a cloud, uh, a cold wall, a cold storage wallet. So here, key, copy, back. Then I go to my account, my other wallet. Maybe I have my other account in Scatter, in Simplios, in uh, Anchor or whatever, doesn't matter. It's the same process. So I will use Scatter, I'll get a pop-up, I will use the account Embezzlement. I, I thought that th that account name was perfect for this video, so I will use the account Embezzlement, um, and I will change, take Allow. And now I have emb Embezzlement, I'm logged in. I go here and I go to Keys and Permission. And here I can see that this uh, key, which contains 1337 here, the elite key is the same in owner and active. Okay, and I want to change that because having the same key in an account is a very unsecure way to store this account. So if I had any value on this account, it would have been a very bad idea. For now, right now, I have zero wax, so it's not a big issue. And right now, with this embezzlement, I'm actually logged in with the active key, which is not... Uh, what I need to do if I want to change the keys. So I will go back, I will uh, go here and I will change to owner because I need to have the owner key uh, active. I go back to wallet, I go to uh, keys and permission and now you see I have the option here to sign owner key and active key. Uh, because the owner key uh, can change both keys but the active active key cannot change the owner key which makes the owner key very important to have secure because if your key that you have as active key uh, is compromised you can still swap the keys so here what i will do is i will paste this key that is found on my ledger i know this because it it ended with with 80 so i know it's the right one i hit change permission uh, and now firewalled why it's got firewalled is because I firewalled. I have no idea why why I get firewalled on this. It should work. Let's refresh. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. Ah, I know why. You know why this this doesn't work because I'm pretty sure in scatter in my settings I have here. You see. Uh, Somewhere here I can turn off here firewall. Oh, here update out. They have removed this, so I'm not making a mistake by signing uh, a new permission when I don't want to. So if I remove this, which is which could be very important, it's good that I get to see this uh, in action, so you know what to do. Now I should be able to do this without uh, refreshing and you see everything is red dangerous 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 someone is trying to change your key and why this uh, pop-up is happening is because if you change the wrong key your account is lost you cannot get it back you cannot recover it if you do this the wrong way and you are doomed and there's actually a lot of scam sites that say that you are logging in but in in reality they are actually updating your uh, your keys so it's very important to see here that eos io which is the system contract on the wax blockchain wants to update your off which is your authentication 
So this command is to update your Epic authentication. So if you do something in a website and this is what they try to do, always say no and report that website as scam because that is a scam site. So here, update off. And then I can see this is the key and this key will be different because it changed to the, the new format. So owner and active key. Yes, this is exactly what I wanted to do and success. And now down here I see I have the new key and this key is now in my ledger. So let's try and uh, remove all these accounts from here. And let's try to log in with the ledger. And I know I had it in number nine. And hit, and now I see I have the embezzlement here. So if I join with the, there, and I'm logged in. Uh, so I swapped keys and I logged in and everything is fine. And now my account is more secure on this little device. Perfect.